Hey guys, how are you? All good? Good, teacher. <clears throat> All right, good to see you guys. Good to see you. Good to see you, Miguel. How are you? How are you, Ellie? So, how's your weekend? Busy. Was busy? Yeah. Why? What do you do? Uh, working. Yeah, was... All right, very good. What about you, Miguel? That's good. What do you do? I was reading the telltale shirt from Edgar Allan Poe. Oh, you were reading? Nice. Yep. Nice, man. Very good. Very good. All right, so, hey, you know what? Edgar Allan Poe used to be one of my favorite writers. That's awesome. So, so, uh, so what is the story about? It's about a man who killed somebody and then he heard the palpitations from the heart. From the heart? The heart. Mm -hmm. Okay. So he heard the palpit. Okay. He heard the, the, the beats, the heart beats, you mean? The beats. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> All right. That's cool. That's awesome. All right, very good. Idalia, welcome, Idalia. Nice to see you again. How are you feeling, Idalia? You good? Okay, right. She's. Uh, there you go, Idalia. Hey, hello there. How are you? Hi. Hey, I'm glad to see you, Idalia. I'm glad to see you too. <laughs> All right, very good. Hold on. Uh, 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 uh. All right, so how was your weekend, Idali? Uh, it was hard because I had to work with my dad, so. Oh, yeah, you told me that. That I was missing all the week because I had to work, but I didn't hit again. Okay, all right, so you had to work and you're here again. All right, very good, okay. All right, I'm glad to hear that. Um, all right, and what else? Well, like, what, what were you doing with your dad? Like, what were you helping him with? My dad has a restaurant, so I have to, uh, when I'm there in, in the restaurant, I have to do a lot of things, like I have to, um, I have to, I don't know how to say it, like use the cell phones and uh, how, how do you say like, I'll take the calls and okay. say the, the, the ordinance, I think. Okay, take the no. orders. Uh, okay, take the orders and send all the. I have to do a lot of things, wash the dishes. Uh, so your dad owns a restaurant. Yeah. Oh, he does really. Oh my God, what restaurant is it? Uh, it's called uh, Cucina Mama. So oh, I've I never heard of that. Yeah, it's like a restaurant from here, from the city. It's like, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's like. Okay. All right, so it's like a restaurant from the city. Okay, all right. Hey, that's, but that's, you know, that's cool. That's awesome. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right, very good, very good, okay. All right, so guys, did we finish the midterm? Did you finish the meter, Medalia, Miguel, Eli? No, I haven't. Oh, why not? What happened, guys? <laughs> we're supposed to have finished the exam, right? All right, we're going to do something now, okay? Um, what we're going to do is that we're going to go through the answers uh, because, guys, you need to have finished the, the midterm already, okay? All right, just FYI. All right, so let's, uh, let's you know, let's solve it together. All right, guys, so, and then we can move on. Hey, but I'm glad to see you. Alejandra, welcome back, Alejandra. How are you? Hi. Good to see you again. Good to see you again. How was your weekend, Alejandra? It was. Was it good? Good, actually. I went to the, I went to the park and I had a time with my friend. Okay. All right. That sounds awesome. All right. Okay, guys, so let's go ahead and uh, finish the midterm, all right, since you already did it. Uh, Miguel, what's the answer for number one? You 
you haven't, guys, let's go ahead and uh, jump into the midterm really, section right now. Didn't. I actually didn't. Do this. Oh, you didn't I do it. I just finished this session. Okay. All right. Uh, remember, guys, that you're supposed to finish this on your own, okay? Uh, yeah. Did you finish section two? Did we all finish section two, guys? Idalia, Eli, Alejandra? Yeah, I finished it. Okay, all right. Time, I don't. All right, guys, I need the screenshot, guys. For tonight, I need the screenshot of you having finished the midterm, okay? All right. Um, so I'm not going to give you the answers right now since nobody did it, guys. But tomorrow, guys, I need you to have finished the uh, I, I need you to have finished the uh, the midterm before you come to class, okay? You're gonna send okay. me a screenshot, okay? Idali, what are we gonna do? You have to send the screenshot. All right, very good, okay? All right, so before tomorrow, and you have to send the screenshot, right? All right, all good, Alejandra? Alejandra, did you finish the midterm? Um, I don't know, I was trying to load it. She's slow, but believe oh so you have i believe but have you finished it i believe that it's just 80 percent completed but um i mean, no i'm sorry it's just 66 percent completed but it's because of the first and second part that is not taking the answers i don't know all right so we're gonna see that tomorrow okay after everybody completes it, okay all right but guys uh please complete it because we cannot move forward guys if you don't complete that midterm okay so we need to move forward mm -hmm. thank you alejandro for doing 80% of it. All right, guys, so let's talk about present conditionals, okay? So who's heard of present conditionals, guys? Me, teacher. No, Alejandro? I mean, uh, Miguel? I don't know why you no. think your name is Alejandro, man, huh? Let's see. So how we heard about present conditionals? Yes. yes. Okay, what are they? What do you think they are? Are things that are like things we wish would have happened differently in okay. versus the reality? Very good. Okay. All right. So the present and real conditional, right? Very good job. So, um, so now, guys, all right. So we're going to use some how do we call unless and only if, guys? How do we call that? It starts with a C. Can, can what? Can what? Conjunctions, okay, all right, so conjunctions, right? Okay, so we got conjunctions. All right, very good, guys. All right. All right, so let's take a look at the first example. So first of all, what is the first usage of present conditionals? Idalia? Oh, you're muted. No sonido. What do you say, teacher? So can you uh, can you explain to me the first usage of a present on real conditional? Do I have to read it or? Yeah, it's you... it's 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 right here. Yes, yeah, you can you may read it. Okay. I mean, if you on know it. On this included sections that would change the speaker's decision. Very good. Okay. All right. Unless, okay, the word unless, okay, clauses. So what is an unless clause? A clause that starts with the word unless, okay? All right, so unless clauses include exceptions that would change the speaker's decision. All right, so what does this mean, guys, okay? All right, so if you say unless, guys, it means that you're changing your mind. What does it mean? What, what does it mean? That we change our mind. That, very good, all right? Write that down, guys, that you are changing, uh, changing your mind. Okay, good job. All right, so you're changing your mind. All right, so you're having a change of heart. You can say also, guys, you're having a change of heart. Okay. All right. Uh, all right, or you can say that you can put a condition, right? So anyways, so let's take a look at the first example. Um, Daisy, welcome back, Daisy. All right, Dalia, let's take a look at, uh, let's read the first example. Okay. I, oh, wait, wait, wait. I wouldn't tell, I wouldn't tell the bank unless it were a large amount. 
Very good. I wouldn't tell the bank unless it were a large amount. Okay. Very good, guys. So, uh, does this mean, guys, okay, what do you think about this, guys? Is this telling you that you would change your mind, yes or not? Yeah. Yes, guys, okay. It's, uh, it's actually telling you, you know, hey, if this doesn't happen, then I'm not going to do this, okay? Got it? Very good. All right. Uh, Daisy, welcome, Daisy. How are you? Okay. She might have, okay, issues with her microphone. Oh, there Hi, you go. Teacher. Hello, Daisy. Good evening. How are you? How was your weekend? Welcome back. Uh, remember to turn on the cameras, guys, okay? So how are you, Daisy? All good? Okay. All right. Very good. Very good. Yeah. All right. There we go. Hey, nice meeting you, Daisy. <laughs> Never seen you in the class. I thought, I, nice to meet you. <laughs> Everybody, nice to meet you, Daisy. <laughs> nice to meet you. All right. <laughs> good to see you here, okay? All right, so, uh, so Daisy, we're talking about present and real conditionals, okay? You might be wondering, what the hell is that? Okay. But, you know, Idali can explain it to you. <laughs> Just kidding, Idali, you're not going to have to explain it, right? Very good. All right, no, guys, okay? Uh, let's read the first examples, and then we're going to go through the, you know, through what it is, okay? All right, guys, so, so what's happening, what's happening with this sentence, guys? What, what happens when, when we use unless here? What is that telling us? That is telling us what, guys? Telling us what? So when I say unless it were a large amount. Very good. It tells us that we're changing our mind. Very good. All right. Very good. All right, Daisy, help me read the second example. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. There you go. Uh-huh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, there you go. Okay, all right, help me read the second example. Oh, I think they, Daisy froze. Yeah, I think her camera froze. All right, uh, Miguel, help me read the second example. I will keep it a secret unless my co-worker continues lying about it. Continue. Very good, okay, repeat, would, not would, would. I will. Very good, okay, so I would keep it a secret unless my co-worker continues lying about it, okay? All right, so is this gonna change? So what is, okay, okay so according to this, guys, what is it going to make, well, what is going to make you change your mind, guys? Welcome back, Daisy. You're disconnected. So, according to this, guys, according to this sentence, what is, what what in the sentence, guys, tells us that you would change your mind? Daisy, want to try? Alejandra. Hi, teacher. Okay, you're right, Daisy. I thought that that you froze again. Mm -hmm. Okay. On the sentence. Yes. So within the sentence, okay, within the sentence, I would keep it a secret unless my coworker continued lying about it. So within that sentence, what is telling us that we are going to change, you know, that, that I would change my mind? Mm. It's possible um, say it about um, can't keep a, se a secret. Okay. All right. Actually, guys, what's telling us that we're going to change our mind, it is? Unless. Unless, right? But um, I will keep it a secret, right? So if if my coworker continues to lie about it, okay? All right. So that that's that's um that's a condition, okay? All right? So if you, you know, uh if my coworker continue lying about it does that mean that i'm gonna keep it a secret or not, am i not gonna keep it a secret anymore guys what do you think so let's say that i am your co-worker Italia, and i will lie about it will you still continue keeping my secret no no right you're not gonna continue keep you're not gonna continue keeping my secret okay very good alejandra number two all right, let's read what the other usage of only if. All right, so what do we use only if for? 
if clauses stress the condition for the result, I would keep it a secret only elect my coworker. Very good, okay. All right, so, uh, so now we're talking about a condition, right? So according to this sentence, okay, let me get, let's read the sentence and tell me what the condition is. I will keep it a secret only if I like my coworker. Well, if the condition is to like the coworker. Very good, okay. So that means that other than that, you know, if you don't like my coworker, all right, you're not gonna keep it a secret, right? Very good. All right, Idalia. Um, well, Eli, next example. Even if clauses are followed by an expected result, um, even if I were really broke, I'd return the extra money to the bank. Okay, very good. Okay, so guys, here we're talking about, you know, imaginary situations, right? All right, so. Uh, so even if, you know, we got an expected result, we would do something, okay? All right, let's continue, guys, with the next part. All right, guys, so what are the conjunctions that we're using here? All right, write them down in your notebook. Uh, uh, Idalia, what are some of the conjunctions that we're using here? Unless, only if, even if. Very good job, okay? All right. Now, can we start a clause with, this, with these conjunctions, Miguel? Yeah. I think yes, so. absolutely, right? Very good. All right. Okay, guys. So let's uh, let let me let me see if we got the example. Idalia, tell me what we use according to the explanation that we just saw. What do we use unless for? Do I have to start with unless? Well, no, you don't have, you, I don't, I just want, okay, not, not, I don't want an example. I want you to tell me what we use it for according to what we just saw. Uh, can you repeat it? What is it? Can you repeat? So what do we use unless for? Uh, to say something that it could change. You will Very, change. Uh huh. To say to say something that you will change is you put a condition. Very good. Okay, we we'll change of opinion. Very good job, uh, Ellie. What do we use only if for? Uh huh. Um, only if <laughs> I didn't pay attention on this. Oh my god, all right, very good, but beautiful. You are beautiful. Well, beautiful. Only if you are changing your mind, um, you don't gonna keep the secret. <laughs> all right, idea. guys, okay, right. Remember, guys, we use it for what do we use it for? Miguel, do you have the, the answer? Yeah, we use it for a condition. Very good. Stressing, right? A condition. All right. Good job. All right. Even if, what do we use even if for? For unexpected results. Unexpected. Very good. Unexpected results. Okay. Very good. Okay. I'm going to ask you again, guys, to write it down. Okay. You should have, take a screenshot, guys, or write it down because I'm going to ask you again. Okay. Beautiful, guys. Beautiful. All right. So now that we know the meaning, guys. Let's take a look at an example, okay? All right, so now, guys, what is the meaning of likely, uh, likelihood? Repeat, guys, likelihood. Likelihood. Uh, likelihood. Something that has high chances to be or happen. Very good, okay. Ha possibility, guys. What does it mean? Um, possibility. Alejandra? All right, it means possibilities, right? Possibility. And Daisy, if you want to have the camera off, uh, if you have any issues with the connection, right? Yes, guys, so it means possibility, all right? So uh, what if we use, oh, uh, this thing froze again, all right, very good. So what if we use, hold on guys, I gotta reshare again, cause it froze. All right. So let's take a look at the following example, okay? 
All right, uh, help me read, uh, Alejandra. I wouldn't take the money unless I really needed it. Okay, very good. I wouldn't take the money unless I really needed it, okay? All right, so according to the usage, okay, what do we use unless for? Uh, Alejandra? We use unless for um, the exchange on the opinion or the decision. Okay, for changing your opinion, right? For changing your mind. Guys, uh, take notes, please, okay? All right, I'm going to keep asking you. I don't like to be telling you guys to take notes. Just take notes, okay? All right, so unless it's actually for changing your mind, right? Very good. All right, so now, according to this sentence, uh, Miguel, what is it that we are going to change our mind about? Taking the money. Or, well, in this case, not taking the money. If okay. they really need the money, I take it. That's it. Okay. All right. So, uh, taking the money, right? So, you're going to change. Basically, guys, this is saying, you know, uh, this is saying if... Uh, if I don't need the money, I won't take, I mean, if I don't need the money, uh, if I don't need the money, I won't take it, right? I won't take it. All right. So this is what it's saying, guys. Okay. Right. Very good. Because it's something that's going to make you change your mind. Now, here, guys, where do you see the present conditional? What is the present conditional here, guys? Alejandro, can you identify the present conditional? Um, well, it's on the verb, right? Okay. With, uh -huh. Yeah, with the, um, how do you call it? The, with the wood, right? Very good, okay, right? So when we use a subject plus would or any model, guys, okay? I would, I could, well, not any model, but models in the past, okay, All right? So when we when we use the models, guys, like that, plus a verb, that's a present conditional, okay? All right, just write that down because I'm going to ask you later. All right, very good, guys. So you see the meaning down here, guys. Now, let me ask you something. So do these two sentences mean the same? Idalia, what do you think? Do they mean the same, Italia? Yeah. All right. Wh why? Because if they are saying that the person will take it, the money. It says, no, it says, it says. Huh? Okay, sorry. It says that the person will take the money if he or she knew it. It's Okay, right, because it says that the person wouldn't take the money, right? Very good, yeah. guys. Very good, okay? All right. We're going to practice in a moment. All right. Uh, what about only if? So what do we use only if for, Alejandra? So, Alejandra, what, what do we use only if? For. I'm sorry, for a, um, uh, for the result, right? For a result. Okay, it starts with stress. Did you write it down, uh, Alejandro? Stress and the result. Very good. Write it down, please. All right. Um, very good. So, help me read this example, Idalia. Okay. <clears throat> I would say them all. Only if I would have needed it. Very good. Where do you see the present condition on here? Only if. No, that is. The present condition. I, no. I'm sorry. Only yeah, if. It's, it's Tell a condition. Um, would. Would. Very good. I would take. Okay. This is present condition. Okay. I okay. would take. I would take. Okay. Right. Where do you see, uh, Ellie, where do you see the conjunction? Only if. Only if. Okay, very good. All right. Good job. 
So does this, Alejandro, does, does the second sentence mean the same? Yes. Okay, very good. It means exactly the same, right? Good job. All right. Uh, let's see. Ellie, let's take a look at the, you know what? No, uh, Miguel, let's take a look at the, all right, at the next example. All right. Uh -huh. I will. Uh, I will take the money, even if I really need it. All right, need very it. good. Okay, I wouldn't take the money even if I really needed it. Okay. Now, uh, where do you see the present conditional here, Dalia? I wouldn't take. Very good. I wouldn't take. Okay, uh, Miguel, where do you see, where do you see the conjunction? Even if. Even if. Okay. Um, Ellie, what do we use? The conjunction even if for. For unexpected results. Unexpected results. Good job. Yeah, plus for you guys. Beautiful. High five. Okay, good job. Good, good, good job. Okay. All right, so it means, guys, that you wouldn't take the money for any reason, right? Notice this, guys. Notice this, okay? This is not contrasting, guys, okay? All right? For no reason whatsoever, you would be allowed or you would take the, the, the money. Got it? So it's very different from the ones that we saw before. All right. So far, so good, guys. Is that clear? Yes, 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 no. Yeah. All right, very good. Very good. All right. So let's practice, guys. Okay. Actually, yeah, let's practice, guys. If I like your practice, guys, we're going to play a memory game. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. So, yes, we're going to play a memory game, guys. But let's hear, let me hear your practice first. Okay. All right. So I'm going to break out. Uh, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna break you up into uh, groups, guys. So what will you do if? Help me read, Alejandra. What would you do if you accidentally dented a parked car in a parking lot? Very good. Okay, good job. Now, what is the meaning of dented, guys? Hit. Very very good. Okay, it's it's just like a small bump, right? Small small bump. All right, good job. Um, next example, uh, Miguel. If the ATM gave you more money than you asked for. Okay. Very good. Uh, Idalia, next example. If you had a legal abortion. Legalize. Repeat, guys. Legalize. 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 Everybody legalize. 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 All right. Very good. Okay. All right, so uh, let's practice, guys, okay? Um, Miguel, do me a favor, take a screenshot and send it to the group, okay? All right. Let me know when you do. Screenshot taken. I need to upload it to this card before I can send it to the group. All right. All right, uh, so let's practice, guys. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Hold on. There you go. Let's go. And there it is. I, I just send it to the group. All right. Sounds good. All right, let's go, guys. Mm -hmm. if you, what would you do if you accidentally dented a parked car in a parking lot? I'll cry because I spent a lot of time practicing for parking. Very good. All right. Try, try, to, um, try to give me, like, very, very detailed uh, answers okay very good job so you'd cry okay very good what else too much effort to practice remember uh, to, uh, remember to practice with that uh -huh. hand okay uh, hello girls hi why are we not practicing uh, Ellie Ellie said that if I 
I can wait for and you said the what? I'm sorry. I, I go to watch the picture and write it down because I need to think about the um sentence and how I can use this um for uh classes <laughs> stress condition and perfect result and something that I can change my mind. So I'm trying to think, teacher. I need. <laughs> I need to read. Okay. Wait. All right. Very good. All right. So uh, let's start, uh, Italian. Okay. All right. Just, um, so, Ellie, just ask the questions and Italian's going to answer them, all right? I need. So, do you need a need? No. Oh <laughs> what do you say? Ask the questions and then Idal is going to answer. Okay, I was thinking at the first one, I was thinking uh, um, uh, the first one is if you accidentally dance in a parking car in a parking lot, maybe I won't tell. I wouldn't tell anyone unless someone learns to. Okay, all right. let's let's ask Idalia. You ask Idalia and then she answers and then you do the, the same thing, vice versa. Okay. Right? She asked me uh, before, so I, I was thinking about it. Okay. okay. So I need to go and watch the other one. To yes. To make or to do to to make her a question, I yes, just ask her a question. To ask a question, to wait, me, me, me. All right, so Idalia, um, so what will you do if you accidentally if the ATM gave you more money than you asked for? I don't know. <laughs> I would take it even if I don't need it. Oh my God, you would take it even if you don't need it? Why? Why? Yeah. Why would you, you do so? Because you know, having money is like, okay, it's okay. <laughs> All right. So, yeah. even if there were consequences, but wait, what else? Give me details. Okay? You got to give me details. I need to bring a full story about it. If the person, if the, no, I'm sorry, if the ATM, is giving you money so more money than you asked for it it's like okay it's okay if you want to give me money i don't i won't i won't i won't I, complain I, yeah i won't complain complain so, complain complain all right, all right. yeah what, what else why else so what will you do with that money? Continue, continue the story. Um, I could buy anything like, <laughs> or I, I could go for food or, I don't know, or buying something to my car or. For my car. For my car. And you know, if you have money, Extra money, you can buy anything. Okay. Or you can sell me. All right. What else will you do? I know. <laughs> All right. Continue. You gotta. You wanna learn how to be fluent? This is how you learn how to be fluent. Okay. Okay. Um. Or if the ATM gave me more money than I asked for, I would. I would say that no. I would say no. Uh huh. Even if he, he, they want me, you to take it. I don't know. <laughs> all right, all right. Continue, continue. See. Well, I can drive a car, but I will not go out on it unless. I was forced to in an emergency. Okay. 
Um, I would. I would go only if it was an emergency. Would you ever shop online? I will shop online unless I needed it. Yeah, I will shop online unless it's a product I can't really get anywhere else. Okay. Hmm. Let's see how you can think of any other example right now. Mm, even if I probably I... won't come up with it with an example, even if I I saw one right in front of my face. All right, very good. All right, good practice, good practice, guys. All right, is it clear, guys? Is it clear what a present conditional is? Is it clear what conjunctions are? Is that clear? Alejandra? Yeah. Also. Yeah. All right, Miguel? Yeah, I'll talk, well, from what I was reading, this one is a real conditional to separate. Although, although yeah. I, I, was, I was checking it. And the normal conditional is slightly different. You're talking about present conditional. Uh-huh. Yes. Yes, it's called, if you want to call it like that, you can say a present or real conditional or just a present conditional. All right, mm -hmm. uh, but good job. If there is present real conditional and there is present and real conditional, all right. But mm -hmm. uh, just call it present conditional because that's what people understand with. Okay, all right. Good job. Uh, let's go back, guys. Okay. All right, guys. Good job. Good practice. Okay. Very good. By the way, guys, I forgot to mention, uh, so this type of conditional, guys, is also called a second conditional, right? Uh, it's called, it's uh, for unreal situations, a second conditional. So you have zero conditionals, you have first conditionals, you have second conditionals, third conditionals, mixed conditionals, right? But the unreal condition, well, the, the present conditionals, guys, in this case, a present, con uh, a present, a real conditional, it's also called a second conditional, right? Anyways, uh, very good. So, any questions, guys? Any questions so far? Or are you ready to play a game? Let's play something, guys. All right. Very good. Uh, very good, guys. So, who has played memory, guys? Who has ever played memory? Me, teacher. Me. Very good. All right. Good job, Idalia. All right. So, this is what we're going to do. All right. Um, if, all right, if you don't remember where the PZ is, you are gonna, you are gonna create a sentence, okay? Got it? Use it. I don't the game. Use it a second conditional, okay? Got it? It could be a, I'm sorry, it could be, I'm sorry, a question or a sentence, okay? Yes? Okay. Very good. So who wants to go first, guys? Um, me. All right, Miguel, right? Which piece do you which piece would you choose? First, I think that, top can, left. You, can you see the cursor? Yeah. All right, very good. So which one? First one, top, top left. left. Mm -hmm. All right, so very good. All right. Which other which other card do you want to select? Let's see. Bottom left. Bottom left, okay. Bottom left and top left. Okay, very good. Remember the answers, guys, okay? Very good, right? <laughs> All right, now, hey, but, but by the way, okay, let, let me, let's have a, let me, give me a sentence, man. I forgot, give me a sentence. Well, I will just screenshot it if I really wanted to cheat. And Very only good. if I really wanted to cheat. Okay, no, 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 <laughs> take a look at the image. Mm -hmm. Take a look at the image and give me a sentence or a question. Oh, in this case? Yes. I will think the cake is true. It's true if I didn't know the cake is a lie. Okay, all right. You're a very complex human being, man. Good job, Professor Miguel, guys. Good job. Good job, Miguel. 
All right, so who wants to go next, guys? Thank you, Alejandra. Let's go. Um, so which one? Upper right. Which one? Upper right corner. Upper right corner, okay. Very good, okay. It's a flower. All right, which, which other card do you want to select? The one right below. Okay, all right. It's a ball, all right. Very good. So give me a sentence with a ball. Or a question. Um, I would play soccer only if I had a ball. Very good. A plus for Alejandro, guys. Good job, Alejandro. Good job, okay. All right, Alejandro, pick someone else, either Idalia or Ellie. Ellie? Ellie, let's go, Ellie. Which one do you want? At the middle. The one in the middle, okay. Up, up. <laughs> All right. Do you want to see, do you want to tell me where the other piece is? Uh, uh, at the right. Okay, do me, do, me, do me a favor, okay? I'm going to move my mouse and you tell me. Okay. Okay, turn right. Turn left, okay? Yeah. Just like that, right? Turn, go up, up. north. Right. Up, 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 up. Okay, you want me to go up, uh-huh? Yeah. I, I am here. Yeah. This one. Oh, my God. I, I know where that piece is, guys. Okay, very good. A plus for you guys. Good job. It was All right, Lee. Good job. All right, so Ellie does not give me a sentence, okay? All right, Ella, Idalia, let's go, Idalia. What do you want? Okay. That one? This one, okay. Okay. Just stop Turn it whenever. Right. Left, okay, over here, okay. No, right, right. Right, okay, right, uh-huh. The last one. In the the last one. This yeah, one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's a flower. <laughs> okay, give me a sentence with a flower. Um. Five, four. Uh, Think about I'll your have, boyfriend. I don't have boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Think about your best friend giving you giving you flowers. No, no, no. I, I wouldn't I wouldn't buy a flower even if my friend is oh, if, even my, if my friend if even if my friend want me to buy it. Wanted me, repeat wanted me to buy it. Wanted me to buy it. Very good, okay, good job. Plus for Italia guys, good job, all right? You could have said I wouldn't buy a flower even if I had a boyfriend, okay? Very good. All right, uh, Miguel, let's go, Miguel. That one. Which one? This one? Yeah, this, that one. A robot. A robot. The one above that one to the left. Okay. Uh, uh, all right, give me, a, give me a sentence with, I don't know, movies, whatever. Let's see. I will go to the movies only if it's a really really good movie good job plus for miguel guys good job miguel hey applause guys come on come on all right very good all right um let's go alejandra um left okay I'm corner. left corner up or down uh down left corner all right a cake the right beside the round, the one besides it. Uh, this one. Or yeah. this one. Oh, this one. Okay. Yes. Oh, it's fireworks. Okay, give me, give me a sentence with fireworks. I would buy fireworks unless it was Christmas. Okay. I would buy or I wouldn't buy fireworks? What I makes, would buy. I would buy fireworks unless it was Christmas. You're literally saying, compraria. Well, actually, that's, yeah, that's true. I would buy fireworks unless it was, no. No, no, uh, no. no it doesn't make sense like that. Compraria, right, listen to this. Compraria fuegos artificiales a menos que fuera Navidad. Is that what you wanted to say, Andrew? Yeah. Are you sure? That doesn't make sense. Yeah, it's not grammatical. Mm -hmm. No, it's the other way around. No compraria, um, right? 
no compraría fuegos artificiales a menos que fuera Navidad. Isn't that what you wanted to say? Alejandro? Mm, no, I want to keep it. But, but the thing is no, that you're, I you're, keep it you're not. Like I will do what. The problem, guys, is that you're not mm -hmm. contrasting the, the idea, okay? The idea needs to be contrasted. So the, mm -hmm. you should you should used to say I wouldn't buy fireworks unless it was Christmas. Got it? Okay. No compraría, okay? So something, okay? So when usually when you use you know unless you're gonna use the negative, you have to contrast the idea, okay? If you're gonna do something, you have to use something negative, negative positive. Got it? So it works like that. All right. Good job, Alejandra. Um, who's next, guys? Oh, Ellie. Let's go, Ellie. Which one do you want? I remember two options to don't make a question, but I don't know if I want to take it. But right. Maybe. Right. I, I mean, gotta take. Uh, all right. Uh, if you guess, I will. It's up to you if you want to give me a sentence or not. Okay. How about that? Okay. All right. Very good. Um, the left part, the second one. This one. This one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um. Oh my God. Um. You forgot. <laughs> <laughs> No, I was it. No, I'm not looking for um. And I want to make a question. All right, but guess another uh, one. Guess another. One. You ha you have the mm -hmm. option, okay? Even if you guess it, you have the option. If you wanna do it, your sentence, go yeah. ahead and do it. Um. Um. The. Down. The. the this one. Okay, it's a tree. All right, let mm -hmm. let me have a, a question or a sentence with a tree. Okay. I will not. How do you say shop? Shop. I want to shop. Shop. I want to shop. 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 All right, uh, good, good, good job, okay. All right, oh my God, uh, next one, okay. Hold on, guys, are you still seeing the presentation? No. Uh, uh, it's just that I was sharing the screen, huh? Are you seeing the presentation now? Yeah, this is small. All right, very good. All right, guys, so, um, let me give me one second, guys. All right, meanwhile, okay. I don't know why it's not coming up. Meanwhile, give me another, um, give me another sentence, uh, Alejandra. Um, even if I, even if I were rich, I would, I would, um, even if I were rich, I would, um, uh -huh. you're good, you're good. Um, like, I, another one. I don't right, know. Um, one. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't buy a, I wouldn't yacht. Uh huh. Yet. Unless I were rich. Unless I were rich, okay? All right, very good. And yes, it is yet, guys, okay? It's not judge, it's yet. Oh, yeah. It, it's, yeah, that's how you pronounce it. Okay, Okay. very well done, all right? So uh, let's go, uh, Miguel. Mm, let's see. I will probably think of a good example, unless I had no idea what it sort of example to give. Okay, very good. So I would probably think about a good example unless I didn't know what example to give. Okay. All right, guys. Okay. All right. But before that, guys, okay, which one is the one that we guessed? All right. Let's see if we can remember another one. All right. Uh, it's back. So let's see if we can remember another one, okay? I think the one that is the ones that were 
already guessed was that. that this one? one? Mm -hmm. Yes, in the middle. Uh, and the one at, oh. at the top of that one. Okay, very good. Okay. All right, only one. Come on. All right. Uh, let's go. All right. So, Miguel, choose another one. Let's see. To the right, the second one from top to bottom. Okay, from top to bottom, this one? This one? No. The right. To the right, this at one. At the right, from top to bottom. Top to bottom, this one? Mm -hmm. No. Okay, oh, the it's, it's the ball. Let's you see. Have, you have guessed the ball already, guys. All right, think, you know what? Yes. Let's, yeah. let's do a free for all, yeah. okay? Whoever can guess the next one, okay? Whoever is the first one to tell me where the other one is. Uh huh? Oh. Up, up right is the flower and down. Ah, well. you, you need to tell me where, where the ball is, where the other ball is. Uh, uh, up, <laughs> there is a, at the right. Up, the, yeah. What? No, what the ball, the ball wasn't, wasn't really discovered. Just the flower. Okay. It's up, it's up. yeah, this one. All right, very good. Okay, all right, all right. I need, I need the ball. Okay, right. So, uh, Miguel, continue. Which, which other one do you want me to choose, Miguel? I actually can't remember, but maybe the bottom right one. Bottom right, okay. Oh, it's no. a flower. Okay, very good. Oh, Miguel, right. give me a sentence regarding the flower. A different it's sentence than the one they gave me. I will probably be a flower unless I didn't have the money to do it. Okay, very good job. Okay, good, good, good job. Okay, uh, Alejandra, let's go. I had to select one or? Yeah, yeah, choose pick two. Sorry, it's just that my internet connection is unstable. Um, the one in the middle, this down one. below. This one? Which one, this one or this one? The one in the middle, down below. This one, okay. A tree? I'm sorry? Uh -huh. We're, okay, yeah, so I chose, I chose the one that you told me, okay? And the middle, bottom, bottom middle. Down one. below. Okay. Yes, that one. And what and else? The one, and the one um, above that one, okay. on the right side. Mm -hmm. All right, that one, okay, yes. so a chicken, okay, I, uh, that's a rooster actually. All right, so give me a sentence with a uh, rooster. Um, or a question, you know what? Change it for a question. A uh, uh, question. What would you do if you had a rooster? Very good. Applause for Alejandro, guys. Good job. All right, guys. All right, guys. We have two minutes, guys, so we don't have more time anymore. So, guys, do you want to try to guess where the other ones are just, just for fun? Actually, that one I remember. Where's the other three? Okay, where's the other tree? It's to the left of the bucket. The left of the bucket, this one? Yep. Good job, okay. Right, the flower, where's the flower? She said here and here, right? Mm -hmm. Very good. Where is any, something else? The one is in the middle of the, uh, I don't know how to say cubeta. Yeah, that one. All right, no Spanish, okay. Hi, no. guys, bucket, that's this is a bucket. Okay. Shows, shows the, uh, the right, this down one? or the right, yeah, this one. Uh-huh. And, and then shows the... Choose, not chose, choose. <laughs> shows the, at uh, the left, the second one, down. This one? No, the, the second. one at the left of the here, tree. Here, here. This one? No, no, no. The other tree. The, okay, no. this one. Down. Yes. Yeah, this here, one. That one. Okay, good job. Good job. Are you doing good? What else? Um, the one which is in the middle of the bucket. Like this one? No, no. This one. Yeah. That one, yeah. Okay. That's a robot. Oh, no, no, no. I don't know. I, I don't remember that <laughs> one. The robot is uh, at the left. Pa, 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 pa. All right, very good, right? So we're good, guys. Okay. <laughs> uh, we don't have time anymore, guys. Okay, all right, guys. Did you have fun, guys? Did you like the game? Yeah. Did you remember the game? Yeah, I like it. All right. Good job, good job. All right, uh, guys. 
Um, I'm sorry, guys, but I have to be more strict, okay? I am going to communicate, guys, these to English Corporativo if you don't bring, if you don't send me the midterm before the class tomorrow, okay? Okay. I have to have completed yeah. that midterm. Yes, Alejandra, Eli, Idalia, Miguel? Yeah. Yep. Very good, okay, yeah. right. Let's get early, guys. Thank you so much, Alejandra, for connecting. Eli, Idalia, Miguel, nice to see you guys. Have a nice tomorrow. Night. Take care. Sure. Bye. You guys.